Well, how you doing up in the dub? You know, it's a water size cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. We finna do you, baby. What you been doing? And this is for all signs. So don't take nothing personal. Don't try to make it fit in because see, that's what people mess up at. They be trying to make their stuff fit. I'm not trying to make it fit for you. If you don't get it, you just don't get it. It ain't meant for you to get, you know. And that's what I learned. Okay, now, so let's get to this reading. And also, thank you for blocking all black magic out the at this room. It's not welcome here. It is blocked at, the, at this table. You are not welcome. It is not done. It is done not on my family, my friends, or anyone that is here to watch me. It is not, will not happen. And it is taken care of. And it is done. It is done. And nobody's going to come on here and just try to put some black magic on her, buddy. Because I ain't finna sit back and play with you. I'm not here to play with little kids. Look, I'm here to tell you something. That's what I'm supposed to be doing. So let's see what's coming out for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. What we need to know, baby. I can tell I'm getting on somebody's nerves. What's going on? Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. Did I lose anything? I didn't think I lost nothing. Okay. It's something about some stress. Someone is seventy someone is getting has some stress going on. Stress and there's some evidence being found on someone. Someone's trying to put some evidence. Fifty five. There's they're stressed out about some evidence about some potion that someone did to fifty eight that someone did to someone. And their commitment, somebody was committed to doing something, 34, someone 34, they was committed to doing something that they ain't got no business doing. And somebody's trying to plant evidence, so, okay, somebody's been trying to plant evidence on you. So I'm going to tell you a little secret. You got to watch out because there is these people, there is people out there that don't mind. They don't mind setting you up. What they got to lose, what they got to lose, nothing. All they got to do is to say, hey, contract in, that's it. But somebody thought they was liberated to do it and you wasn't going to find out. See, that's what the problem was. And see, you have here, but everything is okay. They want you to let you know it's going to be okay. So relaxation, you know, 69, you keep relaxing. Don't worry about nothing. And this to this bully, the 68, just leave it all to us. Because they're not going to let you mess with your sex, your self-love. So 143, they were living in a nightmare with someone 70, over someone 75. Someone was in a complete nightmare. I mean, you could have just said, I mean, why would I have to live through this? This is just because you choose. See, this is what we're saying. We choose to stay in a situation that we are not happy in and then blame ourselves. It's not your fault because it just didn't work out. But that's the hard part about everything you get yourself into. Relationships, even with your children. They don't know the stopping points. There's a time and a place. You have to stop being, doing crazy things that you got no business doing. You know, once you stop doing these things, things will start looking up and it'll look a lot better for you, everyone. But see, you got to be committed to, you got to be committed also. You got to have some kind of commitment, too, because, see, somebody be overindulging. And that's a lot of the problem when they be going on these adventures that they be taking. And these adventures be, they get a little costly. So, but you live and you learn. I just want to let you know, you live and learn, okay? You live and learn, and you keep your goals. And... In real estate, someone needs to stop doing that. Because marriage is on the way. 
No stress should be even growing in your head. Just plant good things and you will gain. You are going to triumph. And you don't need nobody's liquid or potions to make it. Because that's what they're trying to gain at. Giving you potions, making you a third wheel. But you got to show yourself self-love to walk away. Will you stay in something that just does not show you self-love? It does not complete you. It don't even make you happy. But you just stay in it as a third wheel. And you know it's going on, but you don't want to see it because you know it's a collaboration and it's a curse. See, that's what it looks like. Are you going to be the good news about that curse and that loss and that loneliness you went through and that readiness to stand up, to readiness that you promised a homeless person? You have to remember, we all have faults. We all had to go out there and we all had to be strong. This is going to be a nightmare when you wake up. If you wake up tomorrow, you made something, you did something right. But don't go in tomorrow with a bunch of anger, a bunch of narcissistic ways. I can't apologize because I'm... I think I'm better. No, you're not better. You're just a stupid need to be road hard. And somebody need to take a whoop. And, and if you had old days, tie your ass up. And that's the legend entertainment purposes. I wouldn't care if I was whatever. Go into this new life. What order? With, I'm not afraid of you. Why should I be afraid to walk outside when I've been walking all this time just fine? Why should I be intimidated by someone that closed my mouth because all oh, he said, I'm going to whoop you? Why should I give up my whole life, my whole way I think, for just one moment of fame to be heard? Why should I do that? Why should I have to sell everything I have, take all my goods, take everything I have to be, just to think so I can pretend I'm a woman or I'm able to make mistakes. I don't give a damn, you a woman and you gonna make mistakes. Age ain't got shit to do with it. Your mind outgrows sometimes another. And the other stays behind. And you got to help that one get up there. But when that one catch in line with you. And you both start seeing eye to eye. You're going to wipe so much things out. That you never thought you could do in the first place. But you got to believe in your own stories. Your own shit that you put out. It's not always not us. Well, you better listen to us and we can be a man and we'll figure it out. No. If you're going to tell me to be somebody's man or woman, then you're going to have to step up. And you're going to have to show that person, I got you. I am your blanket. I want to hold you. I want to be there in your life. I want to show you what I can be as an individual. Not as a thing, but as a lover into your life. So I can make you feel better instead of making you feel gross when you look at me. I never tended to hurt you. The only thing I wanted was love. But sometimes I got caught in them fantasies. That love was all it was. That's not true. We have to remember. Love is an energy. Love is a source. The power is within you to love you and love everything about you. Then once you love you, first you love the Father with this in you and love you, man, you're going to come out on top. And once your mate realizes it's no fight, and it's over, we together, baby. Like, share, subscribe.